Babe, it's magical what you up to Can I have a minute of your time? Hey there everyone, I'm Daesh here, back again with another video and today we're gonna do an unboxing. And in case you don't know, we don't do much unboxing on this channel, but sometimes we do our unprofessional unboxing. Now in case you are not aware what is unprofessional unboxing, it's a simple kind of unboxing that everybody does at home and so we're gonna do that. Now there are a lot of professional unboxers here on this platform, YouTube. So go ahead, watch those channels if you'd really like to watch how professionally the box are open, but we are gonna do it unprofessionally. It's upside down, sorry. So there we go. So this is what we are gonna do unboxing here, but recently I have actually set up a one more rig, uh, which is like a top shot, so you're gonna see some of the shots from there as well. I know it can be done I'm only asking once, would you let me Take a minute of your time so without any further ado, let's get started and we need to change this camera lens because this is not wide enough for our unprofessional unboxing. Let me do that quickly. So this is super wide lens and yes, I can probably do an unboxing of like this much of a box but this is just a teeny tiny box. So there we go, this is our box and we are going to unbox this. And now, yes, I know the title says it, MacBook Pro, can you focus on this? Okay, I think it can. Okay. And before we unbox this, hey, Apple haters, I invite you to just come in the comment box and just say, hey, you have purchased a bad device. Hey, this is not the latest one. This is not the modern one. Come on, go ahead. You can do really better than this. So go ahead and just do that. But yes, on top of that, I have bought this and we're going to bring back our pen because we do our unboxing with pen. Strange, because this is not a professional unboxing. So how I can open this? Okay, there we go. See, pen also works. You don't need a professional knife for that. So we're gonna do this. So let's just see that. There we go. The final MacBook Pro is here. How we're gonna put this out. Boom. Ta-da! There we go. Nice and easy. So this looks pretty awesome. Pretty cool. It's a nice finish here. So what we're going to do is now we're going to move on to our next rig that I have just built and we're going to do rest of the unboxing there. So let's just move there for a quick second. So that was my other rig where we do unboxing. So let me bring this back here. Okay, so what we're gonna do is I accidentally turned it on. This this is a pretty dope MacBook, and this was a quick unprofessional unboxing of it. It comes with a touch bar. I don't know whether I'll be using a touch bar that often or not, but this is it. There is nothing much to do. There is a laptop, there is a charger, and that's pretty much it. Of course, no ports, <laughs> just four ports. That doesn't do much here. So this is here basically, and you know what? This time I have bought the space gray one. It looks white in the light, but it's actually the grayish one. I hope you can see that. Oh, there you see. So it's the black one. I do already have had the white one. Let me show you that. So previously I was having this MacBook, which is bulky and beefy, have all the ports that you can wish. And the really only thing that I miss from this old MacBook 
is its light. When you turn it on, it actually glows. When you turn it on, actually, I hope you can see that. No, nope, you cannot see that. So it just glows when you turn the light on, while this one, uh -uh, it doesn't glow up. So that's it. That's pretty much it for the unboxing, unprofessional unboxing of the new MacBook Pro. For sure, I'll share the feedbacks of how this device performs and everything maybe later on if you wish that. But these unprofessional unboxing are just fun videos. If you want to see the more professional kind of unboxing and what actually the content, how this matte finish looks like and all these things, you can probably watch it dozens of other videos. This is just fun stuff. So that's it for this video and I'll surely catch you up in the next one.